Hey everyone, welcome back to our channel. Today, we've got some serious news to unpack regarding Lil Durk and his crew, OTF. If you're a fan of hip-hop, you won't want to miss this. So, grab your snacks, sit back, and let's dive into the drama that's been unfolding. If you are new to our channel, support by subscribing and don't forget to hit the notification button for more updates. First up, let's talk about the big news, Lil Durk has been arrested. Reports say it happened during a routine check, but things quickly escalated. Now, we all know how the legal system can be in the music industry, especially when you're dealing with high-profile artists like Dirk. Lil Dirk has been making waves in the rap game, and with that success sometimes comes scrutiny. But what's really got people talking is not just the arrest itself, but what happened next. News has surfaced that shortly after Dirk's arrest, homes of other OTF members were allegedly raided by Florida Marshals. Yes, you heard that right. Multiple homes were reportedly targeted, and the timing has raised a lot of eyebrows. For those unfamiliar, OTF, or Only the Family, is a collective that includes some of the hottest names in the game right now. So, the question on everyone's mind is, why were these homes raided? There are a few theories floating around. Some insiders suggest it's related to ongoing investigations into gang activity, while others believe it might be tied to Dirk's own legal troubles. Social media has been buzzing with speculation. Fans and critics alike are weighing in, and the conspiracy theories are running wild. Some say it could be a tactic to intimidate the crew, while others think it's just a part of a larger crackdown on violence and crime connected to the rap scene. This situation isn't just about legal issues, it's also affecting the community. OTF has a significant following, and many fans look up to these artists. The impact of raids like these can ripple through neighborhoods, affecting not just the artists but their families and fans as well. Many fans express how OTF's music speaks to their struggles, their victories, and everything in between. So, how will this affect their connection with the community? Will it drive them closer together, or will it create a divide? So, what's next for Lil Durk and his crew? Well, it's hard to say. Legal battles can be long and arduous, and given the current climate, OTF might be under more scrutiny than ever. Fans are eagerly awaiting new music and updates. Will this situation inspire new tracks? Will they address these issues head-on in their lyrics? One thing's for sure, the world will be watching closely. What do you think about the raids? Are they justified, or is it just another case of the system targeting artists? Drop your thoughts in the comments below. If you enjoyed this breakdown, don't forget to hit that like button, subscribe, and ring the bell for notifications on all things hip-hop. Thanks for tuning in, and I'll catch you in the next video.